this leadership of this Mahamati Manu Shakar, there has been a phenomenal growth relative to India. 7.6% Bengal, 4.98% uh, 4 and perhaps now lower in all of India. People don't know this and I'm sure Honorable Chief Minister will talk about that. We are delighted that we have based ourselves on transparency, e-governance, e-process in the entire matrix of the state. For example, today as small industry, you can register on computer alone in going into the process of registration for VAT. You get a certificate back from the government in dematerialized format. Only state in the country that has dematerialized VAT return when you get that certificate. No other state. In the e-governance area, Honorable Chief Minister said to me once that in the railways when she was there, she introduced massive e-tendering to bring transparency, to bring openness, integrity of the system. You'll be happy to know that we started with four departments, then to 14 departments, and today I'm proud to say that in the government of West Bengal today, all tendering are on e-basis. You may not know that the growth in taxation, receive in taxation wonderfully and spontaneously given by the industry of this state. It is a record for India for all time. 31.57% rate of growth during 12-13 in the area of collection of taxes. How has it happened? Due to massive e-governance, and integrity of the system, no deals, nobody can make a deal. You have pay your honestly your taxes and 31.57%. What perhaps you do not know, which Honorable Chief Minister said this in a press conference, I noticed that it, was, it should have been further focused, therefore I am repeating, reiterating, the growth in development expenditure, that is plan expenditure, has hit a record of 33.22% this year, 2012-13. Why hasn't it been reported? I would wish that you'll report the fact 33.22% growth in plan expenditure, which means bridges, which means roads, which means hospitals. It has gone from 14,000 crores to over 18,500 crores during 12-13. So this is the bulwark of the small and medium enterprise. When you have a road, when you have a bridge, bridge when you have a structure that supports you you go forward let me submit to you the cluster movement which you will hear a lot about initiative of the honorable chief minister is escalating why because you get economy of scale you get economy of scope you get banking you get marketing because you are clusterized economy of scale economy of scope so i would only say the infrastructural dimension financial achievements of the state the optimism in the state today is remarkable to me. Everybody I speak with who are on the ground and many of the industrialists here making new investments. You have seen the chief minister's meeting in Mumbai where the who's who of India was there. In fact, probably the GDP of India's 15% or more was the net worth of the people sitting there. Why did they come? Because Bengal is a happening place today and that is where everybody is being attracted and I'm so happy that you have an MSME process. So I would sum up by saying, whether it's financial dimension, whether it is e-governments, e-tendering, e-process, transparency, integrity, we are proud to say that this state is at the top of the line, repeatedly being recognized by the center, as well as other states, as a leader in thought in this area. Honorable Chief Minister, it makes me proud to think that under your leadership, having an impetus of implementation, every district honorable chief minister has visited already twice. She's doing a third round of visits for implementation. So I, as a humble entity of this cabinet with my senior colleagues sitting here, am proud to be here. I'm so proud to be able to be shoulder to shoulder with you. And thank you so much for coming today. Lot of deliverables in the next six days, I know. And with those deliverables, I hope it will energize your life. Small and medium enterprises, the bulwark. Let me end by saying,
it is not only the bulwark of Bengal, not only of India, but now it is clear that the middle stand of Germany, middle stand of Germany has saved the German economy to grow at 2%. You will lead the charge for Bengal and for India and for the world. That is our hope. Dhunnabad, Namaskar. I am proud of the fact that you are here.